didn't stop him. Last thing was was a bleeding lady bleeding out oh in the toilet. Behold! Oh. What happened? How so, did we end on such a cliffhanger? Previously on LA Noir, a woman was found bleeding out in the toilet. What else is new? Okay, all <laughs> okay. right, Patrick. Come on. Huh? Come on. I imagine this is what most women's restrooms look like, though. Heavy flow candy? Instead of doing a previously on, yeah. we'll just do we'll just this. this. So uh, um, I'll be the director. I'm going to be casting Elise as Cole Phelps. Oh, wow. Very Congratulations. Well, uh, Patrick as Roy Earl. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And Jacob yep. as the sound a printer makes when it's printing out <laughs> okay, sheets gotcha. like this. So, um, okay, so new objective, investigate Interstate Bus Depot. I think I just saw Hammond. I'll tail him. You get in there and stay with Candy. Make sure you don't let her see you. Roy! Call an ambulance! Hammond got away. Just try and sit still, Candy. Who shot ya? Was it Albert? I told you that cocksucker was a crook. There you have it. This caught is up. where Remember we are. We're all caught up. We're bringing this whole tragedy to its conclusion. Oh no, we're starting in the middle of something. Oh no. <laughs> I found evidence of foul play. Shit herself to death. <laughs> Blew the bowl sky high. <laughs> oh, she must have shot herself with a gun. Where was she hiding Case this? closed. One shot fired. Ooh, that's a clue. That means Whoa. five more for daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like the Los Angeles the Peach just got a little bit changed. richer. The Egyptian theater. Where are we headed to, James? We're gonna get to, oh, to the, the Egyptian, Egyptian theater. theater. What is happening? Are the gremlins here? <laughs> oh yeah, it is the gremlins. Started on fire. Isn't it funny that Lincoln was killed by a man named Booth while he was sitting in one? In booth. Yeah, they call it the Booth Booth now. <laughs> you can't write this stuff. <laughs> oh. Kill a cop and it's the electric chair. How many armed men are in this theater right now? I think there's two. One. Oh, that was a headshot. <laughs> <laughs> You're under arrest. Roy, look, I'm on TV. <laughs> What's TV? <laughs> Good night, Mr. President. <laughs> I was just asking Patrick the other day, should I start smoking cigarettes in my 30s? And I said, yeah, of Now's course. the time. Oh, yeah. yes. I think yeah, it'll make yeah, me yeah. look extremely cool. Your 30s are when you're most capable of bouncing back. Mm -hmm. exactly. Like, from oh, a health standpoint. That's when you should do the most risky things. Excellent. It's, uh... It feels good, and it's cool. <laughs> uh -huh. So Continue, doctor. Uh, looks like some sort of love triangle between the manager, the fighter, and the... Uh, his girlfriend. Classic. I've been there. <laughs> You've been at the center of a love triangle? Yeah, or... with my manager and a dame. Wow. <laughs> I was the fighter. Okay. Yeah. It's homicide's problem now. That's uh -oh. a new record. We finished it. Oh, look at all those clues. Case closed. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. All right. L.A. <laughs> Noir. Good work, gentlemen. Next time on L.A. Noir. <laughs> and then we'll do a whole episode. Yeah. Oh, the war! Ah, <sighs> Phelps, come on, you, you gotta come back, man. There, there's something, yeah, there's Where definitely something that happened at war, but I don't know what it is yet. Sometimes war just happens at war, and that's, that's enough. True. No, we need to get some morphine abuse. So we're in the Pacific Theater. I think so, yeah. Yeah, it looks that way. I can tell from the flute music. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's what it sounded like during yeah. war. Just there's <laughs> one person. You know, there used to be a person to play the drum the whole time. Yeah, yeah. In more modern wars, there would just be someone just just playing a, uh, flautist. Yeah. yeah. The 22nd are still fighting! I'm recommending you for the Silver Star and promoting you to First Lieutenant. Now, I don't have the authority to do any of those things, <laughs> so essentially I'll be telling no one. So what the scenario there was that his friend got blown up and then he yes. didn't. I think he just happened to not die. Are you wounded? Not a scratch, Kelso. He did, yeah, yes. he didn't die. And... Well, he used the corpse like a hollowed out like Taunton or whatever, oh. and uh, he just stayed in there all night like a coward. Oh, I thought you meant he wore another man's skin as a puppet. Yes, and... correct. Oh, okay. Yeah. So he dead. took out the bones, he deboned a man, mm -hmm. crawled inside, had his friend sew him up in his last moment mm -hmm. before he passed. <laughs> we were just talking about how Patrick could do that with James's body and fit inside. It was perfectly. Ryan's body. It was Ryan's oh, body? Yeah. Why not James's? I don't know that I'd be big enough for Patrick to fit in. I think if right, I took out yeah. all the bone and muscle and everything and it was all that remained was skin, I feel like I could at in least get I, in. I mean, in Ryan's yeah. body, I think. I think he's tall. I think we're underestimating Certainly how much. Certainly easier yeah. to get into Ryan's body. Also, the, your crotch is not gonna fit in my crotch. <laughs> oh, it'd bust out. It would it burst, burst out. But burst I would, the seams. But I'm in Jinkos in this scenario. Right? Oh, oh, wait, okay. before you climb in? I, cl after? I climb in and then slide into some Jinkos. Oh, okay. I yeah. think there was a Norse tradition, ancient mm -hmm. one, where you would make skin pants out of. Can we, James, can we search for the skin pants? No. no. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's in a different hand, <laughs> but I, I wish I could, at least. Well, I you really would make wish skin pants out of your fallen comrades legs and uh -huh. you would wear them Is to the honor him. Yeah, do you leave the cock attached? Yeah. 
Yeah. Uh, I also have that question. Or do you, question. does, I, does you, your cock That's what you're slide, asking too? Does your cock slide through the old cock hole the like same way yeah, like, the same way you put your face through one of those billboards at a beach? <laughs> Give yourself a little extra size, yeah. maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's exactly how it works, guys. Is that what wow. you're talking about? That's those exactly. Giving yourself yeah. a little extra size by <laughs> sliding into it. 100%. Yeah. That's why I brought with? it up. If there's extra space, what do you put inside to fill it up? The pants were secondary hey. to the penis sheath. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Is this a different? Where are we? Oh. I only brought it the pants up so I could, so you would ask. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Like stop crime scene. James shows his pants. <laughs> oh, shows his skip pants with the cockatiel. Is, <laughs> Is that a trampoline? That's how you catch someone from a flaming building. Oh, that the fire, makes sense. The fire department. You go, 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 Hold on, I need to test that trampoline to see how bouncy it is. Oh, good call. Trampoline like that should be able to prevent a front end collision, no problem. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry, testing the trampoline. I think Excuse we're all me. in agreement we'd all rather hit the ground back first instead of face first, right? Nope. Oh, nothing. Oh, no, I want to land on my head. I feel like either way, you're suffering catastrophic injuries. Although, as long as your skin is intact so that another person can wear it. Protect the penis. You idiot. Mmm, these open roads. Oh, Hollywood time. <laughs> well, let's go. Let's see if there's snow up there. <laughs> <laughs> James always gets close so he can see the road. For the love of God. <laughs> For the love of God. <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> Plowing it like, like a cattle grate. Homicide guys are already inside. Sorry we're late. There's Ryan Haley. What's up, Ryan? Come here for a second. Oh, bring that question. skin over here. Get, get over here, Ryan. Let's, Let's check see out that skin. Yeah. I want to see if we could cut your leg skin off, cut a hole, and stick you our dick through. You got pretty good. Like, you don't have any skin afflictions or anything, right? Not that I know about. No rashes, no nothing like that. None I can see. Okay. Would you be willing to, when you ultimately die someday, sadly, uh -huh. have Patrick okay. honor you by wearing your legs skin as pants? As pants? We're talking yeah, like pants. belly button down. Well, yeah. would I fit you? <laughs> I think so. I mean, I, I could see my legs kind of sagging down your butt a little bit. Now keep in mind, Ryan, we're going to be taking you to a tanner's to get you all leathered out, oh, yeah. too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're going to take my skin to a tanning bed? To no, 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 a, a, a tanner's that no. would like cure leather, the, the really. Patrick knows. The only way I will mm. accept this deal is if you make me into some Jinkos. That's what I mentioned them out Really loose and... Right. Two things there. Don't need your permission. You're going to be dead and we're going to do it. Um. Secondly, <laughs> uh... Right. Of course it's going to be baggy like Jinko's. That's yeah. obvious. There, we're talking about pants here. Is yeah, there another like, form of pant? No. Do we have your permission? We're doing it. You know what? I'm yeah. feeling generous today. Y'all can turn awesome. my skin awesome. into Jinko pants when I die. Thank you. Uh, Ryan, you I caught me one, on a good day. I have one hang up, Ryan. You what? seem to be implying that Patrick does not, in fact, have a wagon. You're saying that you're going to be a loose fit on him. Uh-huh. And I'm not sure how we should feel about it. Well, that. I'm just saying that my wagon is is even fatter and juicier, and so therefore it's going to be too big for Patrick. We're going to stuff you full of hay, <laughs> so that's not going to be a problem. Okay, well, this, uh, this is all new to me, this concept. So, uh, uh, yeah, you can do do whatever you want with my body. I don't give a fuck. Awesome. <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> Thank you, Ryan. All right. Thanks, Ryan. Have a good day. That's Thank what he you. says in the mirror every morning. You can do whatever you want to me. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Thanks Whose trumpet is that? I think a club owner and two musicians died. Give it a suit. I was exploring his case. I accidentally put his different uh, mouth guards or whatever you call them mouth on the trumpet. Pieces. You sucked um, on his mouthpiece. And then it popped open a thing revealing the musician's hidden heroin kit. Oh, oh, cool. oh. oh my god. Mm, beautiful skin. Yeah, check his legs. See if we could fit our legs inside them. Ooh. Ooh. Morphine tartar. That's my favorite kind. <laughs> Maybe, Maybe habit forming. forming. Mm. Yeah, no way to know. Put that back so. in there. No way to know. know. This side. What Let's do you got see. over here? Any secrets? Yeah. About this side. A little lower. We haven't checked his pants. Yeah, let's yeah. see that Johnson. <laughs> I want to see his trumpet. Spring has sprung, and our friends in Manscaped, the leaders and below the waist grooming, have the best tools for some spring cleaning in your pants. Trust me, your confidence will be blooming like the flowers. Look your best this spring and join the other 8 million men who trust Manscaped. Use code FUNHOUSE to get 20% off plus free shipping at manscaped.com. From the lawnmower to the toner, Manscaped has a lot of great products, and I guarantee you will be getting a lot of compliments on your manscaping when you use Manscaped products. Manscaped is here to change the way all the fellas can take care of ourselves and groom with the Performance Package 4.0. Inside this ball care bundle, you'll find their lawnmower 4.0 trimmer, weed whacker ear and nose hair trimmer, crop preserver ball deodorant, crop reviver toner, performance boxer briefs, and a travel bag to hold your goodies. The Lawnmower 4.0 trimmer is an elite electric trimmer that provides a proprietary advanced skin safe technology. This trimmer is designed to trim hair on loose skin. Although your balls might look like punching bags, 
we don't have to treat them like one. If you purchase now, you will receive two free gifts, the performance boxer briefs and shed travel bag. Always use the right tools for the job and head to their website and check out all of the tools to help you upgrade your hygiene routine. Save 20% off and free shipping with the code FUNHOUSE at manscaped.com. That's 20% off and free shipping with the code FUNHOUSE at manscaped.com. Your balls will thank you. Oh, these COVID tests. Is that what that is? I think they're... Oh, yeah, I know you're right. They're COVID, COVID tests. tests. I mean, here's the thing, though. Is like, what if you're honoring your friend per this tradition and penis too big to fit in friend penis sheath? Well, like, yours is too big to yeah. fit in theirs? You cut yeah. the hole to size. Yeah. I think you're allowed some a slight... Uh... You cut a slit in the in the tip. <laughs> so, so one penis coming out of another? <laughs> what the heck? Oh. What kind of jazz club has guns in the back? <gasps> like, I recognize this one from war. <laughs> Oh, time for an interrogation. We should get back to the station and check the details of what exactly was lifted from that ship. Oh, I want to talk to my girlfriend first. Yeah, let's Ma'am, talk I'm to Detective her. Phelps, administrative vice squad. Single. All right. Uh, what do you know about the shooting? Any idea who did the shooting? No idea. It was my day off. Oh, well, if, if you weren't here, honey, you couldn't know. I'd be full of holes just like the others. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but are, are women not incapable of flying? That's true. <laughs> <laughs> like they didn't fit her face on right yeah. under this video game body. Well, she's wearing someone's skin. Oh, okay. Wow, this is the best we've ever done. Yeah, we're on it. <laughs> Next stop, crime. Yeah. How, how do we get it? Oh, oh, there's another body over here. This one. I have no idea what you're talking about. You don't know what we're talking about, huh? Well, that's a lie. I don't believe you. You knew these men. I bet you know a lot of men, yep. you hussy. You're out of your depths here, detective. Okay, well, do you know who would know? <laughs> People are dying of overdoses. If you know anything about it, you need to tell me. Where can I get that stuff? <laughs> Drugs are against the law, Elsa. What are you, some sort of counterculture hippie? It's against the law. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize. <laughs> Look at that picture. He's a gifted artist. Okay, well, yeah. he holds the notebook good. against their face and then <laughs> oh, chases that. It's, a, it's, a, like you it's would like do a bronze rubbing. Yes. Yeah. It's not enough to just survive. You have to try and make the world a better place. Like I did when I, when I climbed into my partner's belly and slept at night. <laughs> Best sleep I've ever yeah. had. I slept like a child. <laughs> but I cut a slit in the end of his dick and I put my dick inside it. Mm -hmm. It was a perfect fit. And he was bigger than me. I didn't even have to do that. It looked like he was the one peeing. <laughs> <laughs> now where are the drugs? <laughs> where am I? We're tailing someone, huh? We're following her. Wait, cool. Following Just her be a normal car. Just be a normal car. <laughs> Just a normal car. Is this part of the case? Oh. Just, Jesus Christ. <laughs> In my defense, uh -huh. those gas tanks did not appear until no. I hit them. Show a replay of that. <laughs> That's not my fault. I've heard of you. You're the guy who uh, he wore your friend's dick, huh? Yeah. This I recognize this actor. Yeah, he looks very uh, familiar. Who is he? <laughs> I think he's a Marvel character, isn't he? Sandman. Yeah, that's that's, that's clearly that's Sandman. 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 Yeah, that's Paul Rudd. That's yeah. Sandman. Your brother-in-law, Lenny Finkelstein, was selling stolen morphine. Selling morphine, I understand, but this stealing really grinds my gears. <laughs> that ain't okay. I don't know anything about what Lenny was up to. <laughs> Why did your mouth hang the gate when you said that? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Lens. Lie. Yeah. Lie? I don't know. It seems pretty confident. You're right, Truth. Prominent white people popping their clogs makes everyone nervous. <laughs> oh, yeah, you ever get your clogs popped When back? isn't that happening in Pasadena? <laughs> we need that morphine. <laughs> Whores have been around since the Bible. Whores have been around since the Bible. Yeah, you ain't not wrong. a minute before. It's the oldest profession other than wrestling. It goes wrestling. The whores that wrote the Bible. Aren't you supposed to be working? What's that leprechaun want? Let me stop you right there. <laughs> oh, give me your gold! <laughs> this way. Oh, okay. Is he still looking? Oh, it is cold. It is cold. Yeah, All right. right anyway, I'll be heading out now. You <laughs> <laughs> can't see. That's a lovely little patio there. Hey, go, maybe go have a smoke break. Yeah, maybe just go look at him through the window out here. I can't wait to take smoke breaks all the time. <laughs> when you start smoking. Oh my god, it's gonna be awesome. He's gonna start working anytime now, I bet. Soon. Any moment. I mean, I he's not just so. gonna sit there, right? No, that'd be crazy. That's something a crazy person would do. Take your pants off. <laughs> <laughs> he's still staring at where I was standing before. Is he blind? I'd he's be. been faking it this whole time. He's just pretending to work. Wow. I do, feel do, like do, do. as a detective, this is like my responsibility to report. I'm going to tell my boss. Okay. Wasn't he your boss? Or was he another different man? Lieutenant? <laughs> the lieutenant doesn't work. 
Who's All right, there? I'm gonna solve this okay, case. Well, Goodbye. See ya. <laughs> All right. One question at a time. Hi, Cole Phelps. One question at a time. Cole Phelps. One question at a time. Uh, it'd be a shame if like a car went driving through oh, that, that crowd of people. I would never think of something like that. Like a fire truck. Now a fire truck on the other hand. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, my God, oh, my God. oh shit! Oh, you got one. Scram, you insects! Get out of here, reporters! <laughs> Scram! And you guys are better now. Trying to do good work. <laughs> yeah. Hey, whose car is this? Not again. No, no, no. I think he turned off. <laughs> he just like, like a tree. Cole Phelps, LAPD. <laughs> Did anyone see what happened here? Oh, All right, fellow? I'm done. I'm not gonna do it again. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> Tricked you. Well, I don't even know where we're supposed to be going, so Me I feel like this is a good stopping point. Next time on LA Noir. Oh my He's God! Wielding. <laughs> Sorry, my fault. <laughs>